All right, what's up, everybody? I am back. Just getting this tweet sent out. Awesome. That is out. That is in. That is there. So, um, okay, we're good there. My stream is fully up and operational. I uh, was finally able to hear back from Twitch. Thank you and shout outs. Huge shout outs. What up, Archaic? Huge shout outs to Opie. Thank you so very much, sir, for finally being the one to answer me when I couldn't get an answer for any from anyone. Um, I was talking to him about partnership things. Hey, Yosuke. And all that stuff. And, uh, you know, I was talking about what I did and how much, you know, growth I've had and, and all that stuff, which, of course, most of my growth was when I could be more consistent before I started this job and all that. But, you know, I let him know all that, that, you know, the since my amount of time to stream has dropped that my viewership have dropped naturally uh, but he still said he, th he thought I had a great chance and to apply and so I told him that I did <laughs> already quite a few times I was denied but wasn't ever told why and so he had me do it again of course I was denied again same generic copy paste reasoning and I let him know and so he was giving me feedback on that finally because nobody else would and he was saying oh if you had like a hundred some concurrence you probably get it and I applied when I had like 150 concurrence and I still didn't get it and so from our conversation it can be deduced that it's more based on my games um, because of the fact that I can't play the big you know super blockbuster games a money but mostly the motion sickness I can't play those games because most of those big games that are popular and everybody really wants to see, since I'm not an esports guy, are going to be those games that have that camera panning that makes my stomach sick. And so I've probably been getting turned down because the people who are not him, <laughs> who look at the applications, um, you don't feel that even at 100, 150 concurrence, I can hold the audience, even though y'all know good and well that I've held 300 fine when I've gotten hosted or rated. Um, so I think I have to build up at this point to get back to like, I'm going to have to just try to get like 200 concurrence before I can apply again just because of the type of games that I stream. Um, you know, so I'm brainstorming, going to try to brainstorm ways this weekend on how to try to uh, increase my viewership on borrowed time and on this type of content so it's good I finally got answers because it gives me a way to plan so I well you know and that explains why other people who have my same numbers are getting it that's because they can play those games so they're seen as having more potential than I do because I'm just playing a lot of JRPGs um, which you know kinda sucks it's kinda like I'm, I'm being hated on even though I can't physically play those games but I'm not taking it to that far level. It, it is what it is. It's how I'm looking at it. Yeah, it may be that or not, but I don't care. It, I, I just needed answers, and I have answers. So now I can strategize and plan and uh, figure out what I'm going to do from here on. So I'm going to take the weekend. I'm still going to be streaming, of course, obviously. I'm just saying I'm going to take the weekend and try to figure that out. And I'm most likely going to be doing some item rooms tomorrow, so I'll be trying to just think about things to try to figure out what I can do while I'm doing that. So, of course... That'd be perfect time to do it because I'm not, you know, going to be streaming. I don't know if I'm going to do YouTube or live stream. I might do... Uh, it's going to be YouTube for sure, but I don't know if I'm going to live stream it and then export it or if it's just going to be straight to YouTube. But since it won't be no cam... Since it will be no cam, no mic, and just either... Pardon me. Either this game's music or whatever other random music I have. That'll give me time to think about it while I'm doing item rooms and figure out my next strategy. So... Finally answers, yay, after months of <laughs> trying to get one. Um, you know, it's definitely going to rely, it's definitely going to, I'm going to require the help of everyone trying to help put the word out there, but I got to also figure out ways on my own to get myself out there more. So I got to brainstorm that. So that's the order of business today. That's the business end of what's going on. Also, um, hopeful potential. Uh, so like y'all know <clears throat> I'm a contractor oh yeah I'm going to reach the goal you know I even I even told all of these thoughts to Opie and I, and I was like okay you know, I even told him well that sucks that 
you know, yeah, I was like, yeah, you know, it seems like it's a little bit unfair that I can't, that other people can get it just because they can play those games and I can't, but I'm not going to let that stop me, and that I'll have day nine numbers, and he seemed to be pleased with my attitude towards that, so, because I mean, you can either, you can either be two ways about it, you can either be really mad about it, and of course, I'm not going to say I'm an immaculate human being, and I wasn't frustrated when I first heard that. Yeah, you get frustrated, but you you after that initial frustration, which I only was frustrated for about two or three minutes or so, um, you can either suck it up and keep going, or you quit. And I'm a juggernaut. We don't stop. No barriers can stop us. You know what I'm saying? I'll just break through any wall that's there. And so I'm just going to keep going and I just got to re strategize. And that's fine. I play Japanese RPG games. If I can't strategize in real life, I have no business playing them, right? So, you know, that's where we're at. And we'll get there and it'll be awesome. I want to show everybody hey, I can do this with what the games I do play. I don't need to play AAA blockbusters as much as I may want to. And, you know, we'll figure it out from there. But uh, yeah, anyways, about the uh, about the the job thing, got an email sent out from one of the supervisors. They sent it out to all of the contractors, which I think there's like nine of us right now, something like that. Um, I promise I will get to gameplay soon. I just want to get all of this out of the way now. Um, there, he sent out an email uh, with <clears throat> an opportunity for. Uh, full-time employment and it's for an associate IT help desk agent I don't know if it's the exact same as what I do now or if it's more along the lines of what I used to do back in Oregon all I know is it is a really good increase in salary like 25% of my salary my current salary increase uh, and it's full time with a company, so no more contractor status. So I actually get benefits and paid holidays and stuff. Um, and then I can see the internal postings if I want to just try to get into the security team. I could be the first ones to take a look at those and all that, or L2 or whatever the case may be. So uh, I sent my resume. He said, if you're interested, give me your resume as soon as you can. I, I re-edited because I didn't edit have my resume updated for when I started this role. I edited that on my lunch today. <laughs> and I got it over to him. I was working those Google Docs, yo. And so I got that over to him. And I'm hoping I can stand out from the other contractors because as far as I know, I am the only one who's gotten like five of the kudos awards. Basically, that's whenever people give you feedback on uh, your work performance. Um, and so everyone's always because when I got my first I got my first one like my second day on the phones which you know I just do a good job all the time I help people it's what I've been doing for years you know not years like I'm an oldie but you know for like four years what up everybody sorry I'm in like ramble mode how you doing red moon and doom and you rider loot um, but yeah I got my first one like my first couple days on the phones which was like five days after my training started so it's like my seventh day on the job and I got Nakudo and everybody thought it was awesome because they were like some people go a year before they get their first one it's now been five weeks that I've been on the phones and I've gotten like five that's like unheard of like nobody gets five in their first month on the phones so I'm hoping I put that on my resume too so I'm hoping that helps me stand out from the other contractors and they're like yeah this guy needs it more He's got better experience. He he's earned it. So let's hope for that. <laughs> Let us hope for that. Um, you're bored tonight, so you're actually gonna watch. You only watch when you're bored, Doom. Is that why you're only ever you're never here anymore? Is that what I've become for you? Ah, oh, that sucks. <laughs> All right, okay. Enjoy your Skype call. I'll see you back here. You'll call back just in time to have me be killed by something, I'm sure. As per the usual. But yeah, so I applied to that, so I'm hoping I get that because, you know, 25% pay raise, benefits. 
yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Paid holidays, yeah. You know, plus I've been willingly pulling in this overtime, like Wednesday. <laughs> um, I have to be to work at 5.30 in the morning instead of 7.30. Um, do you, though? <laughs> do you? I don't know. Um, but yeah, so some good stuff coming in the works. I can strategize now and figure out how to actually grow from here now that I know what I need to do, which is half the battle. Knowing is definitely half the battle. And so I'm pretty pumped about that. Now I just got to hope that my plants that I do work. And then uh, hopefully I get this other job because then more cash and then I can buy games and I can buy the newer consoles so I can stream like the new games that are coming out that I really, really want to and at least be able to showcase the newer JRPG games that no one's going to play. Like the new games no one's going to play on Twitch, I can play them and show you. And that would be awesome. So yeah, that's enough of that business talk and whatnot. Basically, there is potential, and I'm being super positive that this potential will shine through. I just have to figure out how to make it. And with that, we are under leveled, so we're going to see how this next fight goes. <laughs> and then figure out if we need to what we need to do about that. I'm actually a father of two. Oh yeah, Lahado hit level fifteen. So he's like a beast right now. 198 mana. We can get more expensive stuff if we really wanted to, but there's no point. I do want this improved counterattack though. Hey Spy File, how's it going? How's your leveling going? Hasn't started. Um, I will probably level your character tomorrow. And it's most likely going to be off cast. Uh, what I want to do, which is what, one thing I'm going to try to focus on tomorrow while I'm thinking about stuff, is try to get all these level 1 characters and, you know, each of these low level ranks, get them ranked up to level 10 to unlock new classes. So I'm going to try to unlock a lot of classes. And then once I have all the classes unlocked, then I can make people. So, well, I mean, I only made a scout out of a necessity at that point. So you'll just be made something better later. So don't worry about it. You'll be a, you'll be something better than a scout later. Like who wants to stay a scout forever when you can be, you know, four classes stronger? The location specified in the challenge was Jolten Joltenheim, correct? Why is something wrong? Well, the gate that leads there is being opened from the other side. It's as if someone were waiting for you, Prince. Danka, <laughs> a confident foe, isn't he? Very well. This may be a trap, but I'll enjoy it anyway. Absolute zero. No story. Oh, attack minus fifty. Defense plus fifty. Ally damage twenty percent. I don't know what that means. Does that mean your allies do 20% if you do a group attack? All I know is this is gonna suck. This is gonna be a tough one. Uh, I wanna get rid of this ally damage. I think. Or maybe I go, maybe I turtle? Maybe I send somebody to go kill those. Maybe I send Laharu to go kill that one. defense one, yeah. It's gonna make it tough. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna do this. I've never done that this way before. 
Let's just let them come to Laharu. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Why did I just take damage? Uh oh. They're they're blocking that, so everybody's taking damage every turn. That's not good. I don't know what ally damage means. I assume it had something to do with that, but I don't know what that means. It hurts all of your characters every turn. But why not his? Is it because I don't have anybody out? Here I come. They aren't your allies, but that. But doesn't that mean like if I have allies, I, I don't. It doesn't say like enemy only. That's why I'm confused. Is it enemy only? Is that what that is? You know what? We're gonna leave the mages out this time. Just gonna have the big bodies. Even though Neko doesn't really have health. Oh, they're both level 10. I can make the next level of that. All of your characters will be hurt when they're out. Which I figure, but is that's what I'm asking. It's, it doesn't hurt bad guys. Okay. That's what I needed to know. Because it didn't specifically say this is a bad guy skill. So. You know, I should probably have everybody out anyway. Just to kind of heal and help kill. Megastar. the hell peppers no maybe I should keep that defense one up <laughs> maybe that's a good idea for now Star though. Here I come. Nineteen. Yeah. Yeah, the throws are so good. 
They're so terrible. So weird. Not terrible. They're so good. I guess it doesn't matter if I heal them right now, because they didn't even take any damage. <laughs> but I need to heal myself. <sighs> oh, I guess he took damage, but whatever. Our heals are more important right now. 45. Oh, man. oh wait, he already did stuff. I did this horribly out of order. Strike. Shop. Come on, pretty raid. Ugh, how pretty you fail me. Why do you fail me? That was a waste to do, honestly. And 37 is not bad for 50% defense, though. Alright. Who didn't go yet? Yeah. Alright, well, we gotta protect her back, so. Alright. This... They might all three die. Yeah, 50% defense and my attack is down 50% and she still did 37 damage. That's not bad. See, I want to keep the defense because I don't want the Hell Peppers to destroy me. You know what I'm saying? So I got to keep the defense. We can beat them without it. Being gone. Battle of Attrition Hype. Yeah, pretty much. Alright, so... We should be able to... Ten, twenty, yay.
Wow, you must have some monster defense on you. Hmm. She's gonna have to use her poison heal here in a sec. If she lives this turn, which she probably won't. Let's just be real here. See, this is why I have to keep this up because we're getting tagged. Tagged and teamed. Yeah, she, our healer's gonna die. She's totally gonna die. I'm gonna have to get Lahadu over there to bust a heal on both of them because he needs to heal anyway. She's effectively out of the battle. <laughs> Haru, you need to help you. Yeah. Let's get you here. Kind of block that off. I don't think we can win this battle of attrition. I need to get this dead. Oh man. That's gonna suck though. I do that. I think we're dead. Let's be real here. We might possibly be dead. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do something really dumb. I'm gonna do something really dumb. Something really stupid. Why did I do that? I have no idea. These guys are level 24. I can't beat them. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did something stupid. It just like doubles their levels, just straight up doubles. I forgot that it did that. Oh, this is bad. We're definitely gonna die now. Good to know. Should have parried them? What's up, baby? I don't think parry is a thing in this game. Ah, <laughs> yeah, we're dead. <laughs> Let's do that again. Um, our characters are also a little bit under leveled. Like, if in this game, I've noticed like if you're the same level as the enemies, you gotta have gear that's better than theirs. Oh yeah, there's no parry in this game. That's not a thing. This is this guy, yeah. Hour of Darkness for PS2. Alright, so the 
ladies. Brawler. Battler. Warrior. So we got a Ronin. Now we've got a Knight. Okay. So now does that mean I need to get my Ronin and my Knight to level 10? Before I can get the next class past that? I don't even know. I don't even know what I need to do. I was told Yeah, you get monsters as you kill them, uh, they unlock. I was told that once my brawler and my warrior were level 10, I would unlock a samurai. I'm thinking I need to get the ronin to level 10 before that happens. So... I should just pull up a skill tree, a class tree. Or I'll be here forever doing, trying to do this, figure this out. It's good. Classes. Sorry, this is gonna take just a second. Archers, you have to unlock. A player has to have a level 3 weapon mastery and a bow. So probably won't have an archer ever. I have the male clerics. We have the male, the female clerics. They have higher HP, speed, and defense. So probably won't make a male cleric. Scout. I already have that. The samurai. Master of spears, swords, and axes with high aptitudes to boot. Often the best all-around characters requires a female brawler and a female warrior at level 10. Knight. There's the female warrior. There's the female brawler. They're both level 10. Maybe I have to do this fight first before they to exist at the same time on the player's team. Okay, so maybe we need to just do like an easy stage and just have both of them go and beat something up and then it'll unlock. Let's try that. Let's try that. We'll just like go to the tutorial stage, have both of them on the same team and then let them just go destroy everything. Okay, get out there. Reiner. Then you get out there, Nickel. Wow, everybody wants Reiner. Everybody loves you. Ah. 
Let's see if that counts. Okay. I don't see a samurai anywhere. Oh gosh, it's begun again. So maybe the Ronin is the samurai, and maybe it just has a different name. So let's see. So Ronin is the samurai. Why do they call it Ronin instead of samurai? I thought that that was where I was confused. Yeah, I can make Kaiko now. Well, their mastery of fists is like that of brawlers. What a ninja is best known for is 110%. Translation and versions, probably. Okay, that makes sense then. Aptitude and speed, allowing it to even evade magic attacks. To unlock a ninja class, it requires a male brawler and a male warrior. Isn't Oni a masterless samurai? Well, yeah, but I just meant like... I thought the class was actually samurai and I had like a helmet or something. Because, I mean, technically, they're not Ronin. They have a master. It's whoever creates them. So, they would technically not be Ronin. Brawler is martial artist on the wiki. Is that? No, it says Brawler on the Disgaea wiki, yeah? Okay, so I gotta make a level 10 male Brawler and a level 10 warrior so I can make the ninja... Thief. Horrible aptitudes, stats, and weapon mastery. Uh, he's the only one who has a 99% chance to steal from enemies. And they fill up the bonus gauge faster. And they can steal stats from enemies. What? So you need a brawler and a warrior at level 5. Either gender, either gender. I have a brawler and a warrior. So is Scout the thief? Is that the thief? No. Or a rogue, I mean? Is the rogue the thief? Knight. While well, their average ability and weapon mastery stats and aptitudes leaves a little to be desired, the knight can not only learn three elemental spells on its own, but when attacking normally, there's also a random chance it'll do a double attack by casting a spell as well. Requires a female warrior and a female mage at level 10 or higher to exist on the same team. So we unlock the knight. Majin is the ultimate class and the cheapest. <laughs> Aptitudes are above 100%. They have excellent stats to top it off. Weapon mastery for all weapons is up high. Uh, they also make it way too easy to utterly destroy your enemies. Requires a male brawler, male warrior, ninja, scout, and rogue at level 200. Well, we probably won't unlock them for this playthrough. Uh, Angel. It requires a female cleric, a knight, and an archer at level 100. Probably won't get that either. An EDF soldier, final humanoid class, mastery of guns, and their very limited speech. They have terrific defense but terrible resistance. Uh, you gotta have a weapon mastery of 30 and gun. Probably won't have that one either. So we, it looks, it seems like we've, uh, no, ninja is different. So we got the brawler, the male warrior, female warrior, mage skull, male cleric, female cleric, the 
thief. Yeah, the thief and the rogue are the same thing, it looks like. Yeah. Their beginning tier getting 40% and defense aptitude. Yep, that's it. So the rogue is the thief. They can throw six spaces. They can steal items from enemies. Uh, so what does it mean they can steal stats from enemies? Does that mean that, that they keep those stats or the enemies just lose them for that battle? It's interesting in the notes that the thieves are female in the Japanese version. Their female voices can also be heard in an English version by simply swapping the default voiceover. Okay. Yeah. They're called rogues. And the first is Gaia. Yeah. As their name changes at level 5. Hey, Dr. Funks, thank you for that host. How you doing? Okay, so that makes sense. All right, so that's the rogue. So we have just about every class unlocked then. And no, male brawler. We just have to unlock the ninja now, and we need that by having a male brawler and a male warrior. So let's make some uh, small funky raid. Yeah, you back here to eat? Welcome back, dude. Pizza, pizza. What up? What up? Hey, Nocturne. How y'all doing? All right. So we have everyone unlocked except, I mean, outside of the super high classes, uh, the archer, which isn't gonna matter because I'm never gonna use one. Scout. Um, thief is the rogue. The Hironi is the Samurai. Okay, so we just need to get the Ninja. Let's get the Ninja real quick. Let's get the Ninja. Hey, North Isley. From here on out, you just need to level up the classes we have to get their awesome upgrades. Yeah, so we need to unlock a Ninja. We'll do that real quick. Uh, and then we'll go on about that. So, hold on a sec. Uh, we're gonna get the ninja, ninja, and then we'll make people, and I'll probably like try to transmog people or something if I can. Might be the best way to do it. Maybe. I don't know. Hey, Villa Jonathan. Sorry about that, I just had to check out classes because I didn't know how that went with the name translations. But now I know. Oh my gosh. Please stop, game. Ow. That's going okay. I just get trying to figure this all out. <laughs> I was confused because translations, but I'm good now. You were playing Fire Emblem. Thought this guy was an appropriate game to raid. Sweet, I appreciate that. Which Fire Emblem are you playing? Now, here's the question. Like, if I got Neko Shogun, Like, could I change Neko and Reiner to their next classes? So here's the question, Reiner. Would you want to change classes? Oh, I need to make the male warrior and male uh, brawler real quick. Or would y'all want? Would you want to like stay in the brawler tree, Reiner? Like, would would you want to just, or would you? 
So like you're a brawler now, would you want to go up to Pugilist or would you want to stay a brawler or would you want to swap to Ninja or, you know, Fire Emblem 7 for the GBA. Nice. I haven't played that one. We gotta make some throwaways. I'm gonna make a male brawler and a male dude. Uh, we're gonna just keep them good for nothing. We'll name them A and B. Oh, no. It'd be cool switching classes, prefer to stick with fist people. Okay, yeah. So that that's what I was asking. So like would you want to be a ninja or would you want to stay in like the monk pugilist? So like would you want to go up to pugilist instead or would you want to swap over to ninja? Ninja. Ninja ninja. Uh, Neko Shogun, I would probably convert to a knight, I guess. I don't know. Probably. I'll wait till Neko gets here, then I'll ask. Same tree, Pugilist? Okay. So then what I'll do... And it's a long cast night, so I can take some time to do this. I don't mind. Uh, what I'm gonna do is uh, try to rank y'all up so you can transmogrify yourself or whatever. And then I'll just have you start over at level one as a pugilist. I think I can do that. If not, I'll just recreate you. So what I'm gonna do first is so we gotta get these guys going out. I'm gonna unequip you. I know, don't worry, you'll get it back. We're gonna give it to Oh, I made two warriors? I'm an idiot. Oops. <sighs> Me and navigating this menu. I'm still not good at it yet. Ah. <laughs> Are you thinking I need to go back? Yeah, supposedly if I trans, I only if I can if I can keep you as you are, you keep your same stats. So if I can swap you to the next class, you keep your same stats. You'd be a swole. I mean, you just kind of pick up as a rank up rather than having to start from level one as that class. So I mean, you'd still be level one, but you'd be as strong as you were. You know what I'm saying so. That's what I'm hoping to do. I made the knight. I need to make the brawler. Make the brawler. B. Let's just murder the synod already. Yeah, see, that probably won't go over well. Here we go. Alright. So let's get them equipped up so we can blaze through this quickly. Be the brawler, yeah. Or will it be A B at the brawler? <laughs> A A the B, I like that. Um I would imagine y'all will want stronger the higher classes, not the level one ranks. So that's really all that is for them. We've unlocked all of them in the first week, pretty much, except for like the Angel and the Majin and the EDF and the Archer, which I don't care about that. Maybe, you know, if we get to the point to where we can unlock an Angel and a Majin, I'll make one. I don't care about the EDF and I don't care about the Archer. So, and I'm not going to get anybody rank 30 in guns or rank 3 in bows. So the only, the only person who might rank 3 in bows would be a Ninja. That would be it, really. All right, let's, let's talk and do things at the same time, so we're not here forever with me doing this. Is this better? It's more attack, but it's less hit. No, not better. All right. Welcome to the Netherworld Hospital. All right, let's go do this. Save guns. Yes, see. 
Rank 30 in guns. I don't want to do that. It's going to take forever. Even if I am doing item rooms, I still don't want to do that. This is Final Fantasy. I know, right? We could probably have them do Fire's Castle. Um, we could probably do the Blessed Court with them. Let's push our luck. The stronger the enemies are, the faster we can do it, the faster this takes. Kappa Lapa. Hey. Finish this. Yeah. Yeah. Safe. Barrett, man, that gun arm. You know. I want them to get their own experience, so we need to switch them over. No sharing. Oh. Well then. <laughs> it's not beer. I don't drink beer. Beer's disgusting. He's got like a super kind of ghetto voice. Save it. It is T. Yeah. Ha. <laughs> Zero damage. I love it. Just do the team attacks, it's fine. Good kind of team. It's just team. Nothing amazing. I'll finish this. It's a sweet tea. And that's about it, really. It's cold tea today. I'll finish this. Maybe I should give him that warrior's axe. This ain't hitting it. Yeah. <laughs> he hits hard. Holy moly. Sushi. Punch in the sushi. Yeah. At least he puts people to sleep, but still. That's not, it's not doing it enough. As long as Aaron does martial arts, sounds like you. <laughs> they don't even have enough SP. Triple strike. He really doesn't like him. Ooh. Are you close to leveling up? Yeah, I want him to get that level. Wow, 
Wow, he just yeah. doesn't like him. He just he he was going for it. I could have played that better, honestly. Alright, so let's give him the warrior's axe. So you can actually one-shot things. Uh, I don't remember this stage. No, this stage sucked. We're not doing that one. We need to do this one. And I don't want them to fight uh, magic users. So we're just going to do this stage. Because cool. they'll get destroyed by magic users and I don't want that. There we go. Get the big axe in there. Yeah. That's what's up. for this monk, yo. Salzburg. Save it. He's got such a thug voice. Save it. Wow. He requires more experience. Boulder Crush. Oh yeah, I remember that move. probably do now is I'll start having just one of them go in and kill everything and hopefully they'll gain a level each time it's gonna take a little bit longer uh, yeah let's get the muscle bra oh 
we'll get the muck in there. <laughs> yeah, let's not go fight mid-boss right now with these characters. It's probably not a good idea. If I were to take a guess. Oh, you know what I should do? Hold on. What level are y'all? Y'all are level 1. I should totally just start tossing y'all. Yeah. Yeah, that's better. Let's start tossing. Because y'all are just level 1s. We need stronger. I need more from you. Yeah. Yeah! Or I'll just kill you. Uh -huh. Maybe I do need to do a different stage because these guys seem kind of weak. I need I need something a little stronger than this. I know the other guy was what level four. So maybe between these two guys, they can't take it. I can at least give it a shot and see. He's level five now, so yeah, I'm gonna have to do the next stage with him. Like too strong. Yeah. Yeah, he was on the bottom and still almost killed him. Yeah. Okay. The see, my worry is, is they're gonna get wrecked by the magic dealers, so I'm gonna have to bring up. Uh, is Hama out there with him too. So she can keep him healed. Huh? We'll have us a ninja soon. Uh, it's, this is going pretty quickly. Yeah. It's going faster than the mages it seems. Since they can actually get up in there, you know. So we got another muscle brawn. That'll be good for A. Oh, it's only 10. Nah, it's fine. What are you even fighting? We're just doing older stages. I need to get them to level 10. So we can unlock the ninja class. It's kind of like Final Fantasy Tactics where you have to have classes at certain levels before the next one unlocks. So we're trying to get ninja unlocked and then I can actually make the crew that I'm going to have pretty much through the end of the game while we're still at the beginning and then uh... yeah since it seems like we're pretty much near unlocking all of the classes that you can unlock without having to be like level 200 or 150 or having ridiculous weapon skill so Yeah, this stage. So these guys are level 3. So it's like an instant jump from level 1 characters to level 3 and 4. So. Yeah. Let's get them out. I keep wrecking some poor things. Yeah. Let's get Miss Hama out. She's also under leveled anyway. 
so. Well, I'm not going to level her right now because I might remake her anyway. Or something. I don't know what I'm going to do with her yet. I'll probably figure that out tomorrow. Oh. Team attacks anyway. get him maxed up. It's only getting like 20 XP. It's terrible. We can probably fight mid boss with this crew because their gear is kind of out of control. Alright, I am for this stage of the game anyway. had some defense. Not enough though. Okay, so now we can get these guys in the mix. And, okay. I could just be wasting SP with her to get her heals stronger. Probably should. Probably just go on up to the frozen liver. Or liver? The frozen liver. That's what it should be called. Because they're, they're not leveling up fast enough for my liking. <laughs> I like to, if, if we're going to be doing this, I want to get it done quick. I'm not keeping these characters, so I'm not really feeling invested in them, so I don't want to take forever. 
Like, I don't mind taking the time if it's characters I'm going to be invested in, but these guys are just going to be straight up deleted when I'm done with them. So, I need to just kick this into high gear. Let's just go to the frozen river. Alright, what level are you guys? Oh, the zombie pukes. What did I do? <laughs> what have I done? Now what happens if I... Oh, I can't end my turn. Salvia. So she's just gonna waste all her HP or SP to heal. Build her heals up. So she can learn the next level one. She should learn another one at like rank six. Oops. Oops. That was my mistake. Tomorrow I'll probably work on uh, building her. It's a snowhorn song again. <laughs> yeah, this song sucks. I'll probably do a different stage after this one anyway. I don't like this stage. I need to build up my major staff skills. So they're. Oh wait, no, they're already rank S. But I feel like they can get. Uh, I don't know how to build up their range. I guess maybe they're already at max range. But Keiko said she could cast spells from half a screen when she played. I don't know how she did that. Hey, loyal minion. The character grinder's going okay. Um, I'm just doing these warriors real quick so I can unlock the last class we need. Uh, the male, the male warrior, male brawler, and I can unlock the ninja. Um, as far as actual character leveling yeah. for finishing the next stages in the game. Yeah, we're going to have to work on that after this. We're going to have to do a couple of older stages or something. Because we got destroyed. I mean, I also played terribly, but... We weren't... Honestly, we weren't strong enough. I knew that going into it. I just thought I could handle it. And then I saw that, you know, there was the ally damage and the defense 50%. I could probably beat it. I would just have to play a little smarter. But then I just... We're still just behind the curve anyway. Because I haven't done any item rooms. We haven't really bought any items. We haven't really... I mean, we've, the only upgrades we've really been getting are from the hospital. From getting beaten up. So, you know, the characters don't have superb gear. Their gear is actually probably very low for what it should be. For some things. Some people have some items that are pretty sweet. Um, but yeah. Well, the thing is, is I get sucked into item rooms, and so I'm trying not to do them so much on the cast, and just do them, like, on the weekends when I'm not working, and then that's just going to be extra YouTube content, because while I enjoy the item rooms, and I know many of y'all do, not everyone does, and I want to be able to accommodate everyone on the stream, so my compromise is that when I do item rooms, it would just be in my spare time. And I would just put it up on YouTube, and those who want to watch it can, and that way. Yeah, they need to be level 10. It's going to take forever at this rate. Oh, I forgot about them up there. Oh, crap. Okay. This is going to be a process. Well, let's see. Oh, she can't throw that high. Yeah, definitely not doing this stage again. This stage isn't very good for that kind of thing.
I can do it. No, you can't. So I have him go up and deal with them. Rip the lemon zombie. <laughs> This is the third time you try for item rooms to be done. Yeah, it's it's tough to get the item rooms done. Like I tried playing once and then I got sucked into them. And so I want to actually beat the game this time. <laughs> I'm used to Karsha, and Karsha the intern's at the bottom, so I keep naturally wanting to go there. Even though I haven't I played the game it. in a long time. Wow. You really wanted to hit me, huh? Dude, that's not very nice. Toss. I didn't really do anything, but okay. We're all in a row. It's good enough. Oh wait, we can't even get over there? Hold on. I'm gonna have to toss him over there? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That's lame. Yeah, this stage is not good for grinding. Okay. At all. XP is good though. So we'll do the next stage. What was that? Frozen 1 or Frozen 2? I don't remember. So yeah, that was like 8 minutes in a game 1 level for throwaway characters. That's too long. Okay, so it was that one. Let's try Icy Breath. Uh, oh, it's more of these guys, so... Uh, nah, I don't want to do this one. Let's just skip to the third one. Who was the boss for this area? Oh, Fron and the Dragon. Use his pawns for Jex ninjas. Exactly. They mean nothing to me. That's why they're taking their time leveling up. They know their fate. Okay, so he's level 6. He's level 7. Alright, this should be a little better. 
know what? I'm gonna toss him too. I hate forgetting about the toss thing. I just do that now. We got them over there too. All right, I might have made this a little tougher than I intended to. Now we're all right. We in there? It's fine. I mean, I guess the healers don't really need levels as long as I just keep their gear, their HP up high, defense up high, and just work on their spells. Save. Still. Yeah. Hey Jonah, how's it going? Yeah, so these two level 8 guys are going to take some time. That's good though. Your package hasn't came in yet? Hopefully it'll come in soon. So yeah, at least their normal attacks suck. Well, except for that one. Uh oh. Mrs. Ama might die. Oh no. That'd be bad. The Haru would have to come heal. Yep, she's dead. Oh. Oh, she's barely not dead. Sorry you left. That's fine. I was just giving you a hard time earlier. Lots of people have come and gone. <laughs> That's real life hits, man. You gotta do what you gotta do. I was just giving you crap. Never ever take my joking serious. It would be silly for me to be upset. I don't expect everyone to be here all the time. Yeah. I should probably bring in Laharu for backup heals right now. This is starting to become a problem. <laughs> I'm no waifu. Hey, Mugusta, what's up?
gonna do now. I was actually kind of hoping they would do that so they can help Pepper the level 8 dude. Um, that's fine. That's not as fine. But that's good. So now... Oh, no one got the experience for him. No. That sucks. Counter. Yeah. That sucks. Boulder Crush is pretty good. Dang it. I was hoping. Bah. This stage seems to take a long time for not much uh, reward. Oh, you just need five? Yeah, sure. I'll finish this. He hits harder than Laharu. Alright, well that wasn't worth. So I'm just gonna probably do the same stage I did with the mages and see if that goes faster. Let's see, Spire's Castle. Was it this one? No, that wasn't it. Oh well. Oh, what stage was it? Oh, it was the first gate outside. Dang it. I didn't want to do this stage again. Back here. Okay. 
Oh, I was gonna double him. Or add to him. At least we cleared this stage out fast. I don't think the other magic stage is gonna help then. I don't know. Is this stage easier than the other one? I feel like the mages leveled up faster on the other stage. I don't know. I can't tell. What stage was it? Wasn't that one. It had to be. Oh, yeah, it was the Magnificent Gate. It shows right there. It's 11 times I cleared it. That's right, he doesn't get the extra experience points though for if he does that. Hold on. Enemy boost times three. Does that mean I get triple experience? Maybe I don't. Hold on. If, if that means I get triple experience, then I'll put it back. But I don't want to waste turns. Building myself up, or building them up for no reason. Might as well just kill that for the experience. Yeah! Red mean. Okay. Mama. Mama. So he had 71, now he's got 58. It's not even worth it. Mama. <laughs> Skull language. I didn't even move yet. Come from your hiding spot. Jerk. Well, I guess it kind of helps. He got... If he's getting 20 per... But still, now he needs 400. That's a lot. Oh, Vopine, thank you for the host, man. How you doing? Hello, everyone from Vopine's channel. Hope you all having a good night tonight. We are currently trying to rank up 
a brawler and a warrior to level 10. So that I may make ninja. So there were four, five, six, that's 20. That's not worth. We need to do a, tar a harder stage. We need to do a harder stage. We've unlocked pretty much all the classes except for Ninja, so I'm trying to do them. I am Ninja, he is Ninja, we are Ninja too. That just reminds me of... I Wumbo, you Wumbo, he, she, we, Wumbo. Ask a Ninja YouTube songs? I've never heard of those. I don't know if this is where I want it to be though. I don't know if this is where I want it to be. These guys are scary. Very scary. These guys are very scary. But I need to clear out a spot so they can get the 100% XP. Finish this. Be gone. Okay, it's not dead. I need some meat shields out. All right, you're my meat shield. Meat shield one. Meat shield two. Now what I'll have him do. <laughs> I'll finish this doesn't finish what we'll just come back. What I need to do first is have him finish learning this. So he can heal his status effects in the uh, rank up fights. Pumpkins are pretty strong, yeah. He can't throw. No! Okay, so he got the extra percentage. He won't get that kill. But he'll be ready for the next one. Oh, yeah, he will. No, he won't. Darn it. Alright, so they might die here. Yeah, I messed that one up. I know. Yep. That's okay. So that just means... Um, he 
this guy can come out. Soften him up. Soften them up, not kill them. <laughs> Soften. Soften, please. Should be good enough. He's standing on the 100% experience, but we can't do this stage for grinding. That's not a good idea. Oh, she's dead. <laughs> she is so dead. She had an AOE. No. Come here. Then, uh, burning knuckle. Huh. Here I come. Blazing knuckle, whatever. Oh, that didn't do much at all. That's a sadness. We have 125, 105. Alright. That's okay, I needed more people to die anyway. <laughs> as terrible as that sounds. I needed people to die. Die. Okay. Special heal. be another meat shield, but I need to stack y'all over here. Oh. I see. Well. I can probably boulder crush him and kill him. I'll finish this! Be gone! Yeah. There we go. I just need to get them all. Okay. So this could work, I guess. It's just... Yeah. I think it'll be fine. Why would they go after him instead of BP Awesome? That's kind of strange. Oh, BP Awesome is dead, so I guess that's why. That we're gonna bolt a crush I'll again. This. Yep. Be gone. I knew it. Okay, good. So we learned that now, so that's good. Have him defend. 
Oh, come on. Have him heal. down there so she's a little closer yeah. too. <laughs> oh, they want to be the next overlord. Makes sense. Actually, we don't need her anymore. No, you weren't supposed to counter. You never counter. What the heck is this crap? Get out of here. Piece of junk. Take food off my table. Why are we using Ganon in a party anyway? I thought he couldn't counter attack, so I was just using him for a big meat shield. Alright. I should just kill her. Which is fine, I have the money to revive them and I need more people dead again, as I was saying. So I can get more hospital rewards. Skull Splitter. A four hit combo. Yeah, let's see this. I'll finish this. Oh dude, that looks awesome. And he's level nine. Alright, everybody's about to start using axes for that skill. <laughs> Blazing core. That is where we want to be for these last couple levels. So he needs 359. If I toss some people, we could probably get some extra experience that way in that stage. He needs 311. Let's save before we mess up. So we'll go back to that other stage where he gave me 50% experience, and I'll just toss everybody on top of each other. Because he can't counterattack anyway. So that actually works out pretty well. And then I can just do the four hit combos. And then I'll get double experience if I can make them like level 6 or something. Then that will help. So let's do that. Hey Nima, <laughs> late to the party, it's all good, how you doing? He does counter now. He didn't used to. Fine. I don't want you to counter. I need you to not be killing anything right now. Maybe if I defend, they don't counter. No, they still counter. I don't know. Mommy. 
just don't counter anything. I don't want him to kill anything right now because I want to toss everything on each other. To make them stronger. Then kill them so I can get the extra experience points. Plus, he's killing them when he's not on the red, so he's not getting extra experience. Darn it. Then they don't chase me, which is another problem. Yeah, whenever you toss the enemies, it, uh... Whenever you toss the enemies, it and they land on each other, it makes them, it combines them, and it combines their levels additively. And so you make them stronger. So I was trying to make them stronger so I could kill them on this uh, higher experience squares. And if I could get one that was level six, or something, and then kill it, then I would get better experience, but it's not working, so. Experiment failed. You have to defend, otherwise they'll counterattack. It seems. But if you defend, then you can't you can't throw and defend in the same turn. He always keeps counterattacking the one that's strongest. So this was kind of a waste. Experiments of success we learned. Yeah, we learned. I don't know if I want to do this one again. I forgot about the De Niro Palace. We could do this one. where Hog Miser was. How did I skip all the way to the Blazing Core? What was wrong with me? Doing that. Hey Kenpai. Are there stronger enemy builds in this game? Or is that later in the series? I have no idea what you're referring to. Oh, for the Senate? Yeah, it's probably in here, maybe, but I don't have it unlocked right now. And I don't want to do that because then it makes it stronger for everyone everywhere all the time. I just want to toss these guys so I can just level these dudes up really quick. It would be a waste of mana to raise the bill and then drop it back down, so I don't want to do that. Brawler City. Hey. Safe. Safe. You'll be a pugilist soon.
Oh, you're level 10. Hi, Freya. Let's bust some combo action on ya. I'll finish this! This stage will work just fine. I wish I would have known about this one sooner. This is where we needed to be this whole time. They are tagging this dude up though. His defense cannot hang. He's doing very well though. He could probably toss one on the other. And do what he need to do, but I don't want to do that. There we go. Hi. I'll finish this. Be gone. Be gone. Oh, he actually got the combo. I didn't want the combo. But whatever. Counter. Dead. That works. 